If I'm Adam, welcome back or welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys footage from my Mavic 3 Pro, specifically featuring the brand new medium tele camera. It's a 1 over 1.3 inch sensor into 70 millimeter equivalent. So this fits perfectly between the wide angle and then the zoom. And this is a 3x camera putting it side by side. So on the left, you have the four third sensor and then on the right, you have that brand new medium tele camera. It's flying down the same exact path and you can just see look from having this longer lens on there. All this footage is straight out of camera, so no color correction at all. And then you can just see the details, beautiful. What I like about this shot is you can see the shops in the foreground, downtown, midground, and then the mountain in the back. And here's just a cool shot of the boat coming back into the harbor. And here's that same boat with the 7X camera. So you can just see the ability to be able to punch in with the Mavic 3 Pro. So this is one of my favorite shots from that day. So the boat's coming to the harbor. I have the lighthouse in the foreground, then the boat's in the middle ground, and then downtown's in the background. And just the compression and all that, you can see that the boat just starts to disappear. And this is a shot that you would not be able to get with the standard wide lens. And this is my attempt at trying to make a cinematic movie style shot. So I'm kind of tracking the car. I got the medium tele camera, you know, getting kind of the best of both worlds between the wide angle and the zoom lens. And then here is a shot using the tele camera. So that's the 7X. It's a 166 millimeter equivalent. And the new one with the Mavic 3 Pro is an F3.4. The original was F2.8. I haven't been able to notice if there's a difference in quality. I still think that it's cool to have this tele camera and remember when it came out it's called the explorer camera so it's never been that good but i guess it's cool to have and then here is another cool feature that the mavic 3 pro has and it now can shoot in m log so you might be familiar with d log and that's what was in the mavic 3 um, but this m log it's a less flat profile and it's supposed to be easier to color grade and i'm not a color grader i'm not really good at that kind of stuff so I usually would skip D-Log, but what's kind of cool about this M-Log is I was able to have some more success. I brought out a bunch of vibrant colors and I really think this is probably the best color correction or color grading I've ever done. Just the color of the water, still being able to have the shadows without the highlights being blown out. I don't know how often I'll use M-Log, but it's pretty cool when it works out. And then how could I miss these two guys? Whoa, there's a seagull. These guys are just jamming on the roller skates. So I'm in the four thirds camera and then I switch to the medium tele to kind of zoom in. And these guys are just vibing roller skating down the street. I don't know, I was compelled to try to get some footage of them. And then that's gonna wrap up this video. So if you found it entertaining or educational, give it a big thumbs up. Thank you, that means a lot to me. Subscribe down below if you wanna see more videos like these and then check those notifications so you'll be notified when I upload my nearest videos. As always, my name's Adam, fly safe, take care, peace.